all your school rugby all in one place. This is Next Gen 50. So we'll wait and Terenier in purple kicking long and outfoxing the right winger and then getting wrapped up. Great gusto, great energy and it's roared on by the boys who decamped from school early today. Calls on his big men to do a little bit more grit and grunt. But it's one too many and another penalty to Terenier. of the lots because it yields three points a modest return for the Terenure pressure the Terenure Jack back to the right Gabriel looking for that avenue finding it and then offloading one more ball slipped on well, the Terenure attack all oh centred around Casper Gabriel at the moment is beginning to purr quite nicely. Success for Gabriel and success for Terenure. They lead Paul Lewis six points to nil. Still the South Africans hold firm. Terenure decide to slow things up and throw in a few numbers. Pick and go, the order of the day. But is there some width? Oh, the dummy is sensational. The try is sublime. Casper Gabriel and Terenure get the first try of the match. Badenhorst, just a little more promoted with Klein hiding out the back. There's a bit of an edging round of Jordan Steenkamp wearing 11 on the right side. Pulled back on the quick tap. But they, still they go. Terenure short here, long ball over the top could do them a real mischief, time for the footwork, slipping and sliding and scoring. The South Africans are in. Myberg low, one sniff and scoring. But this was the genesis of the scrum that came and then the penalty. But this time they hit their man in the skies. Char Charles Holwell brings it safely to floor. The maroon machine cranking into gear, propelling itself forward, almost brought to the floor, but a second lease of life and a try for the South Africans, a second. And the half turned on its head. Continue for all their dominance in every facet of the game. With the Dampy's conversion, find themselves at half time trailing by a point <laughs> hanging around and getting cool on a Thursday night here at Terenure RFC especially when the action is so hot on the field the second half is underway. Terenure 11, Paul Lewis 12. 
and really those half-time talks turned on their head another spiral bomb not defused by the South Africans there's a real reticent to commit but off goes Keenan Stoffels Stoffels finding support inside South Africans pouring through the Terranier backfield a miraculous last ditch tackle a reach for the line and the South African strike right from the kickoff. Moran just lifts it out the back where Gabriel has to reach and he's off balance. And Paul Lewis win the penalty. changed a fair few sentences this evening haven't they Max Duplair and Oliver Reed and once again the indiscipline of the South Africans proving their Achilles heel the decision reversed for the shove off the ball from Henry Duplessis Which he does. And Terranier closed the gap. 14 17. Plenty of rugby in this half to come. Good field position for Terranier. Wow, Paul Ruiz are all offside there. They went very early and it's advantage played. gives you the answer to that question and a man of that shape won't be shook with the knees Dampy's turn to miss touch oh that's a sloppy offload and picked off by Klein great opportunity here with Terranier scrambling all the space on this right edge a race to the corner and finished by Paul Lewis. And Terranier still receiving the ball, still looking to burst through this defence, which has just refused to be broken down with any ease. But now they're nipping through the fringes. Quicker ball, big men running. The biggest of them all, Rui Kani! A sumptuous line against the grain. And cannonballing his way through to the paint. The biggest roar of the night reserved for the man with the biggest heart in the team. Rui Kani with the equalising try. And the ball in the hands of Casper Gabriel. Yeah. And for the first time since the depths of the first half, Terranier retake the lead. One more collision of these two eights on the halfway line. Again, a big blind side that looks like it won't be used. And Paul Lewis advancing. Dampies leaves the ball behind a judge to have travelled backwards. Hey! Hey! Gabriel almost thought he had his paws on it. Duplessis. Dampies to his captain. His captain. 
losing his own footing. One more tackling set for Terenure. One more roll of the attacking dice for Paul Ruiz who find a bit of space. They get a good bounce and on the end for a sensational winner of the death. Yes, they are. Heartbreak for Terenure. Absolute ecstasy for Paul Ruiz. Who oh, look to have won this with the very last play of the match. Ampies. Took a chance in the tee to put a full stop at the end of this. Which he does so successfully. Terenure, all they need is the ball. Paul Ruiz go fishing around. And if Terenure can field this, then they'll get one more chance themselves. The game not done. The box gathered by Paddy Curry under pressure. Just about held, but not by Louis Carney. And the final act in an absolute thriller here in Dublin. Disappointment for Terenure. Delight for Paul Ruiz and as a whole, each and every one here in Dublin breaking out into applause and appreciation of an unbelievable match.